One of the other technologies that we use here at GCP that a lot of other companies don't use is the rapid air system for air void analysis. Rather than a manual LT, which can take a long time and can result in some differences in results depending on the users, we have a rapid air machine which is entirely run by the computer and that way we know that the data is correct and we can run a lot of data very quickly. So what we do with that is we take one of the cut and polish samples that we usually use for petrographic analysis and what we'll do is that we'll blacken the surface, we'll fill in the voids with white powder, and what you end up with is this. And with this analysis, the computer is able to tell what is the white voids and what is the black surface. And that's able to count the bubbles that are in it, see how big the bubbles are, how close they are to each other, in order to look at the air void system as a whole so we can see if the concrete is freeze-thaw durable. So as you can see here, the top sample has been air entrained. It's still an intact sample. The sample that is bottom has not been air entrained, and they've both been through the same number of freeze-thaw cycles. So you can see what freeze-thaw damage can do to those samples if you don't air entrain the concrete. GCP makes a lot of different air entraining admixtures to get those bubbles in there to prevent freeze-thaw damage from occurring.